so yeah, a lot of my inspiration just kind of comes from you, you know movies, uh, music, um, photos I've seen, and just other artists out there. You know, meeting them and talking to them, and just seeing what inspires them. They unknowingly inspire me. You know, going to the art shows, which I've missed ever since all this has started. Uh, you know, once in a while, I kind of get inside my own head, and I think, am I painting too many faces? Am I painting too many of the same thing? You know, and I saw this painting by Picasso where it was really like, kind of like a sketch or just a random drawing and it was just titled face number 234 or something like that. So I mean you know, it doesn't matter how many times you do something, you'll, you'll always learn something new from each piece you do. You know whether it's the way you approach it, the way, the way you finished it or just something different that you did that you didn't do before. You know just, uh, just keep doing what you want to do and keep doing what you love and, and don't listen to what other people think. You know, you know, once in a while I do do the pop culture stuff and I do notice that that sells a lot more or sells easier. I don't know, in the end, like, it's something someone else did. It's nice to know when you create something that just came out of your own head and someone found it and saw it and loved it and, and bought it, you know, so that's, that's really satisfying to know. Great at accounting, Chris. Named Ice Cube from the gang called Cause with Attitude. When I call off, I got a sawed off, squeeze the trigger and bodies are hauled off. You too, boy, if you with me, the police are gonna have to come and get me. Off you, the town.